The year is 2030, and you got your beans and your rice made, and the shell of the burrito kind of reminds you of the moon. And what you'd give to see that moon again, you've been living underground for several years now, in your bomb shelter, making these kind of apocalypse recipes but you know time marches on and it's time to bring this final product to see what we're making microwave some of that rice i put cheese on it because i'm not vegan but if you're vegan don't a layer of those beans some fresh salsa some lettuce and avocado if you got it the avocados i got are way too hard to use yet so this is it, I think. Bringing it in for the money shot. And it's time to see if the show is good. This is called the Barbecue Bean Burrito. And if you wanted this recipe, you can get it in the Thug Kitchen Party Grub version. This was pretty much my whole weekend. Let's see how it is. Mm -mm -mm. That show is good. If you make this, you probably never had anything like it in your life. It's really different definitely put the salsa on thick it needs a thick salsa and get good salsa none of the cheap stuff because that's the predominant flavor in this and we learned a lot about the nutritional information of penno beans in particular it truly is a bomb shelter food that you can store probably for years that's got the nutrition of like a whole burger in it i mean it's got slow burning carbs protein and quite a few different vitamins and the first recipe we made with beans so is good we learned that you can expect to be eating a lot more plant-based foods in your life as a matter of price efficiency and just the efficiency of everything. In fact, we saw that this burrito is already about 20 times cheaper to make than meat. And I'm enjoying it just as much as that chicken one I made last night. I got those huge extra large shells in. I've, uh, this is my first one. I'm already starting to feel it. So it's pretty filling. That's another benefit of high fiber foods. It uh, stabilizes the kind of release of the sugar into your bloodstream. Fills you up and you stay full. We'll see you next time. I'm going to make sure to do some more recipes with dry beans. Truly foods of the apocalypse. Make sure to follow me so you learn the tools of survival.